John's uncle, take Min Mayan as my wife to have and hold for this day forward, for better, for worse, for rich, for poor, in sickness and in health. I love and cherish from this day towards until death does apart us. He takes the warps while looking into your eyes. You look down and your grip on your dress get tightened. Now I declare you both as husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. He walked near you as your heartbeat reached its peak. But to your luck he just kissed your forehead. We are married, but that doesn't mean we love each other or care about the feelings. It's just my innocence. It's me who want to become a god by helping others, even after I get into trouble. This man standing next to me forced me into this marriage, just because I helped my best friend Akka, his soon-to-be wife, to run from this unwanted marriage, and here I'm stuck with him. I might say it's a good catch, but the problem is that this person doesn't believe in love. But the problem is that I have to stick with this cold billionaire in the same house for 365 days, every year. My mind is so in a mess that I don't even know what to do. We both turned towards our relatives and they started to give us blessing without even knowing that nothing going to work with us now. This story is going to take us on the next level of roller coaster ride. Jungkook signed and looked at the paper in front of him. He massaged his temple and looked at you while you looked down. He opened his mouth to say something but again closed it because he doesn't want to take out the word which he will regret later. Can you explain me this? He still showing you the main headlines of the newspaper which were about you. You looked at him and quickly looked down getting stared by his dark ops. I'm asking you something Ryan, explain what is this? It's my part time job and the thing is not that big, it's my normal routine. You said gathering the courage to answer him. But I already told you to leave that job after marriage. That was your past life because this world is so different from your that past life. My world is so different from yours. You can't just live like this now. Now my reputation is you. And no one will digest the thing that my wife is going for a part time. He said as he fold the paper and take out his phone from his pocket. I can't leave my job that is the only source of my money. You don't have to when I'm ready to take all your expenses. As you said, both of our worlds are different. You can't just tell me what to do and what not because you don't know the pain I'm going through and you will never. He threw the phone on the table annoyingly. Why the newlywed wife of a billionaire John Jungle doing part time in a cafe? What do you think? It's look pleasant to read the main headlines about my wife. What others people will think? Guess what? Your world is the hell. Like even if I take breath outside, it will be in the newspaper tomorrow. I'm tired Jungkook. I can't just live like this. I married you because it was my mistake that I helped Mina to run on the wedding day. But that was the last thing I do for you. Now I can't just change myself for this. And they remind you, we are not married, it's just a deal that will finish the day you find someone for yourself. But for others, we are the real couples, Vyan. Just cooperate with me till we both are together. Don't just make the things hard for us. And no one is telling you to change, just stop doing some of your work for some time. You can understand his problem, but you also had your own life in mess. Okay then, will you pay me if I do all your household work? He looked at you shocked. First he thought you are joking but seeing the serious look on your face, he scoffed. Are you crazy? How can I let you do the work? I mean, maids are here for everything and until we are married, until tie with this bond, until then you are my responsibility. I know, but you have to agree for one thing, either this or that. He signed knowing that he have to agree for one thing when he don't want. He looked at you and signed. 
Okay, tell all the maids not to come from tomorrow, but at least let them cook tonight and let's have a peaceful day. You nodded. He nodded again with a deep exhale. How about going to a silent place like the riverside or any of your favorite place if you are comfortable in coming with me? It's not like that, but a place with no paparazzi, no one to make you feel uncomfortable, a silent place. You smiled and nodded. Don't you feel suffocated or uncomfortable by the way they just enter in your private life? The way they ask you questions and sometimes those fake news. Who doesn't but we can't forget how grateful we are to them. Sometimes it's too much. They really went too far, but it's okay. You smiled and shook your head. Give me 5 more minutes to get ready and I will be there. Okay, but make sure it won't take 5 hours. You rolled your eyes on the way he said the last sentence. You flipped your hair and walked upstairs, leaving him laughing by the last sentence of yours. I'm different from other girls. Don't take me lightly. You put the grocery bags on the kitchen counter and walked towards the fridge to take out a water bottle. You poured the water on two glasses, drinking when you offered the other to Junko. You looked at the time and it was already 7, so you decided to make dinner. As Jungkook doesn't know how to cook so he always washes dishes. That's how you got an advantage. Do you need some help? You lift your head to look at him and chuckle. His eyes were stuck on his phone and his hands were busy tapping. Can you cook? Not really, but you can ask me for some other help like if you want something from the market and stuff like this. He said as his eyes never left the screen of his phone. No thanks but we just come after doing lots of grocery shopping then i don't think i need anything now you can do your work i'm sitting here just in case you need my help he said keeping the phone aside you nodded while your eyes were fixed on your cooking whatever suits you you started to cook while he was giving some remarks in the middle it actually feels so good to have a company while cooking how you know to cook you looked at him while your hand was still chopping vegetable and then again focused on the work i'm doing work since i was in high school he nodded why don't you learn cooking i never got time for all that for my parents study is more important than any other thing you made an o face and nodded things were different for me in that case for my parents everything was so important except for study i didn't even finish high school he looked at you shocked really you never finish high school you didn't say anything as your eyes started to get teary he doesn't know what's wrong with you but one thing is for sure He is not liking the tears in your eyes. You know what? My life is also seem good, but it is not. I got parents who want me to do all those things which they want. My interests, my hobbies, they never care of for anything. That's the reason I decided to marry your best friend. I got tired going on dates and stuff, but they are you who make it hard. And I thought you love her. That's why you behave so rudely to me. I never even think to get married. It's just because of my parents. You nodded, and there was a silence for a while when he finally spoke. Are you still angry with me because of the day when I told you to quit your job? Why would I when I am getting paid for living with you and even more than, or approximate double of my salary? He chuckled slightly and nodded before again that silence filled the room. He spoke. By the way, your cooking skills are good. I like the food you cook. You give him a cute smile. You always like it when someone compliment your cooking. Thank you. What was that? He asked, looking at you surprised. Your brows frown in confusion. What? You being all cute. I thought that was never possible. I'm in shock. 
You scoffed at his weird acting and walked towards the fridge to take out some sauces. What do you think you know me? Well, you are back. You smile which is so unnoticed. The remaining time you both spend eating and talking about a lot of stuff related to your problems too. You don't know why you are telling him all the things you don't want to say again. But with him it feels comfortable and ray of belief. They started to pass at the speed of light. Everything went so smoothly. You were silently judging Jungkook and there you find something so strange about him. Something so rare to find in any human nowadays. That how can someone be so pure and nice without any selfness? You want to give this marriage a chance but the fear inside you always drag you back. You don't want to end up like your mom. You witness a lot of bad things and now listening to your inner feelings, you don't want to get hurt again. You are scared that what if this marriage won't work out between you two? What if you left being all heartless and emotionless? and you don't want to become a monster that's the reason you decided to take it like how it is you hold your raised feeling inside yourself and it is your life to decide the things for you you haven't answered what i asked you you snap in reality and looked at him a little confused but then you realize He just confessed his love to you and now asking for an answer. How can someone gather himself to trust a person he just met? How can he knows that you are the best for him? The one who will stay with him, love him, cherish him because in your case you even don't believe yourself now. I know I am taking things too fast but I couldn't help this is what I started to feel with you and I'm liking this new feeling of mine and I'm not even forcing you to love me back because for me you are the best the way you are now even without confessing you are making me feel like a real married man your grip on the TV remote gets tightened yes it was when you both were watching TV and he confessed to you now your mind is in mess your heart wants to tell him that you have fallen for him already and your mind wants to escape from here because it's going to hurt anyway i never did anything which make you fall for me you are my wife isn't it enough to fall in love with you You look down thinking how it could be a reason to fall in love because if marriage means to love that your parents won't break up ever and your mom won't end up in the hands of a devil who treats you both like trash if marriage means more love then he doesn't have to confess to you like this that could never be a reason to love someone You said and got up ready to leave but he grabbed your hand and made you fall onto the couch again I just love you and love doesn't need any reason. It is always bad and good in a person. No one is perfect and everyone is kind and rude according to the situation. I don't show it when I say it. I am more than willingly to be a good partner to you. I meant those words. You look down. You don't know how to say that you still need some time or you want to say let's have a great life together. You don't know even what you want you were like dragging your life to the end without emotions you are afraid to be a monster but slowly you are becoming one it's okay i already said that i won't force you take your time we can remain as a friend like we are now right and about the love then i can wait until you decide to be mine forever i, I can wait for your decision 
You nodded and he smiled and roughed your hair and walked from there with a heavy heart, but still relieved that finally he confessed his love. Tanko quickly pulled you in his arms, being all scared. His heart was beating fast, but his eyes were showing the anger to the person who was standing at the door. He just threw a flower vase, which landed right the place you were standing before. Jungkook looked at you and her glossy eyes were staring the woman beside the old man. You thought that she will protect you but she didn't. Yeah, you crazy man. You don't have any right to speak in middle of anyone's family matter. She is my wife and you don't have any right to curse her like this. Mr. Min scoffed and looked at you with anger in his eyes. Without a blessing of parents, not a single marriage will be accepted in our society. Jungkook feel your tears in his hand as he squeezed you gently in his arms. Child needs a blessing of their parents, but you are a devil. No one want your curse. You should be grateful of her that even after getting married, instead of thinking about her family, she is thinking about you all. You should be grateful for her. Really, you really think she can ever able to think of other when she is all selfish? Look at her face. Such a Don't you dare to go further or else I won't hesitate to rip your mouth. Consider yourself lucky that you got a daughter like Fyan because if someone were there on her place then you might be rotten in jail by now. Mr. Min scoffed and looked at her. You. I wish you also give some of your talent to trap rich men to your mom too. Your eyes widen as you looked at him totally shocked. You looked at your mom and then think maybe she deserved this. It's better if you stop by now or else it won't be good for you and never in your life try to contact with my wife or else it won't be good for you you were so helpless that words are just disappearing somewhere in your heart you want to ask him the mistake you made in your life so that you deserve this but the truth is even if you are nice then also some people won't understand your worth I heard that only step parents treat their child like this but now I see your blood can be more dangerous. He said looking at your mom while her eyes went down. Close the door. We don't need a person like them in our life. He said and walked inside while your mom closed the door on your face. Jungkook looked at you and started to collect your money which he threw back on your face. Didn't I told you not to go alone out? What if something happens to you? What if I don't come on time? You didn't answer as you were so in shock and depression to say anything. You're never able to digest the thing that your own mom abandoned you. He got up and grabbed your hand. There are lots of things he wants to ask you. Let's go from here. He said and took a step ahead but you fall grooming in pain. Jungkook hurriedly checked your feet and it was bleeding. He signed and picked you up in a bridal style and walked towards the car.